Today we will be demonstrating a basic startup and operation on the Control Techniques C200AC drive. For demonstration purposes, we will be using a small asynchronous three-phase standard induction motor with single-phase line power supplied to the drive. To start, connect the line power to terminals L1 and L3. Next, connect the three-phase motor leads to the terminals labeled U, V, and W. Now that the motor leads and line power are connected, connect an enable jumper to terminals 9 and 11. Terminal 9 being the 24 volt output used to activate the inputs, and terminal 11 is the digital input 2 that is configured for drive enable. Once these are connected, plug in the drive to power on. Pressing the enter button will allow you to toggle through parameters. Using the up and down arrows, scroll to parameter 5, then hit enter. Hitting enter a second time allows you to choose from different drive modes. Scroll up to the PAD option and hit enter. Once selected, press the escape button until you reach the ready screen. RDY for ready will show on the screen. Your C200 is now ready to run and can be started by hitting the green start button and using the up and down arrows to set your desired speed. Pressing the red stop reset button will decelerate the motor back down to stop. You have now successfully completed a basic startup and operation of the Control Techniques C200 AC drive. For more information on the C200 AC drive and other tech tips, visit us at gelco.com. And don't forget to like and subscribe to Gelco TV so you can be notified when new videos are posted every week.